Hey everyone, Leatherneck6017 from XDA Forums again with an update on how to install Damien 87's EXE4 file system on your Epic 4G. Uh, this covers using his zip version 1.3 as well as the new kernel and the ext formatter.zip that you can now flash through clockwork, clockwork uh, thereby eliminating the step to even use a computer in the first place. Uh, what I've got here is a fresh copy of DK28 that's been rooted and clockwork's, clockwork is installed on it using the one-click method, version 2.5.5. You'll need to have um, three files on your SD card, probably in the root directory would be best, and those are the ext4 up, uh, updater uh, in, or installer.zip, and then the prepare.zip, and as, as well the new kernel that uh, has been posted. So to start with, what I'll do is just do a, a quick reboot. For those of you don't, don't, that don't know, uh, that's the power up button, power button, and camera button at the same time, and then immediately uh, do the three button method to get into the original version of Clockwork. And if you miss getting into Clockwork, just do the quick uh, reboot again and hold down the three buttons to get into Clockwork. So we're in uh, 2.5.1.0, which is where we need to be. We're going to go ahead and flash the prepare.zip uh, file. That's all we need to do in this version of Clockwork. Now we need to go to Advanced, Reboot Recovery. And that will get us into <clears throat> the new version of Clockwork Recovery, version 0.2. There it is. Now, we'll install zip from the SD card, choose zip, and we're going to choose that uh, ext4 formatter.zip, which is the new uh, way to do this. And we'll install that. And this is going to take a couple minutes, so I will uh, resume the video uh, when it's done. Okay, so it finished up, and uh, without rebooting, I'm going to go straight to choose a new zip and flash my ROM, which I'm using Midnight 2.4 until Mammon can get out his bonsai with the XT4 support. Now, important to note, you got to install the kernel without rebooting the phone. So, choose zip and <clears throat> the kernel I'm using is dk28ext4rfskernel.zip. And that's it. Reboot and enjoy.